they're starting to get a little bit handsy. So the redhead is kind of standing between Brody and Aubran, kind of on one knee. The one with the black hair is kind of going towards Debora and Rom, um, stroking Ron's afro and kind of caressing Debora's horns as they do so. They're all basically trying to entice you. I'd like to walk past the nice blonde lady and uh, just examine the Ottoman. It's kind of like no. They like like people that play hard. hard I'm I'm particularly interested in its heritage and whether it might be worth. Oh, first off, I want to know if it has storage qualities. Might is it a chest ottoman, or is it one of those ottomans that might have a bed inside it? And, uh, and I just, I, I, I'm imagining what Tar's thinking is. He's like, "There's only one woman in my life, and that was Elkie." Yeah. <laughs> no. Yeah. Well, I just, you know, I'm, I'm, if you don't go on all fours, I'm not interested. I want to be clear. What's happened here is that you know, there's three very nice ladies, um, but. Fatar saw the Ottoman and he just thought that I've been needing an Ottoman and that is a classic piece. That one's sold out as well, isn't it? Uh, well, that's what I heard. Limited <laughs> uh, edition. It's difficult, it's difficult to find a good, a good story. Damn Ottoman. good spot. Misfit Adventures. <laughs>